I found a plugin in Ableton. It's a Max for Live plugin. It's called Auto Track Colors. I'm gonna show you guys a quick video of what it does. For all you guys who care about organization and productivity and all that stuff, this plugin's amazing. It's a Max for Live plugin, it's $9. When you add this device to your project, you can set customizable colors for whatever you name the track. For example, if you want your kicks to be yellow in Ableton, anytime you name a track kick, it's going to be yellow. If you want your bass to be blue, it's gonna name it blue every time you name a track bass. This is an amazing organizational plugin, in my opinion. Let me show it to you guys. I just started dabbling with it. This is the plugin. It's just a Max for Live plugin, it only works in Ableton. If I click color settings, this window pops up, set it up however you want. One thing I realized is that you can actually put several names in it. So I could have K-I-C-K, space K, anything with those names will be colored this color. So how I have it set up is my drums are one color, bass is another, vocal chop is another, main and lead is another, FX. So how it works is I make a new track and it's yellow by default. If I rename this kick, boom, it turns blue. And say I wanna name this bass, boom, it turns dark blue. Really simple plugin, but as far as organization goes, this could be a game changer. Shout out to Live Workflow Tools. They made the plugin. It's available on Gumroad. I dropped the link. And it's called Auto Track Colors. Really dope. Got it from the Patches newsletter. Shout out to Live Workflow Tools. Fuck.